a lawyer that would have set him free because he did not deserve to be locked up in no cage for 13 years for standing next to two men who decided to start pulling out guns and shoot at each other. So I, I it's a we, we did the best we could, Dre. We honestly did. We gave up every dollar we had for you. Mm -hmm. We gave up every dollar and no, you probably didn't deserve that, but I know you needed to sit down, but I know you didn't need to sit down that long and it probably just disturbed your mental capacity. And all we can do right now is ask for you to just try to get help and forgive the system and forgive yourself. Cause there ain't nothing we can do about it at this time. The only thing we can do is try to get financial gains so that it don't happen to your nieces or your nephews. That's all we could do right now. So I'm I'm gonna leave that there, and I, I truly beg for mercy for anybody that he has accused, whether it was Callie's man in jail. I know y'all do some ruthless stuff to each other when it comes to this stuff, but I'm just gonna act, beg y'all to give my son a mental pass. Whack, Bodine, whoever he's names he's saying, my nephews. If y'all could just give him a mental pass just for my sake. See, that's the part, right, that you don't be seeing, too. And, and, you know, it's a trip because, like, a lot of... That's why I don't be respecting some of these fake-ass... Bro, these niggas be out here perping and acting like the jail is just... I, that's why I kind of didn't respect what Blueface was saying, bro, when he was talking about, I'm here having a blast. And, and, and that's why I say it ain't you ain't having a blast right now, I bet you. After all them squabbles and all this shit you've been going through, bro, that's some fake shit. And then you putting your peoples through it because you, you know, like, 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 yo, folks, when you go down, right, or some shit like that, I didn't have plenty of this around me go down, right, and I see they folks, they folks feel the same pain that they kind of, like, feel it. Like, you feel it. You can see, like, moms, right? Bro went down, bro went down right, one time. Did, you know what I'm saying? I had to do some little time and shit. And you could feel he was so stressed out now. You could feel it's just he it, it, it wasn't good, bro. You could see that shit weighing on moms. Same shit like this, right? Now it's it's a trip because Dre, right? Blue face brother, he been saying some like kinda outlandish shit. I'm not gonna lie. Like he been saying some shit that, you know, he concerned about blue face and and, and, and hella shit, but he kinda like on some conspiratorial type shit, bro. That's why they saying he need to get some mental health checkups and shit they trying to you know what i'm saying check on his mental because he kind of like you know he i'm gonna just i'm gonna let y'all hear him out then i'm gonna continue to buzz down man brothers they've been planning for like the last eight months bro like i said september 23rd was when they did the first thing against me they, they've got everybody involved this is this is a big thing where they've got a few different people involved my mom i think was whoever got my mom or my sister got contracted to do it first and I think that from there, it spread out. You know, I think they started getting people to be involved from my mom and my sister. Um, I think the deal was to help get rid of my brother so that my sister would try to get try to get put on. You know what I'm saying? And and I think that it, it, it's, it's really, really horrible. Um, it's really, really a horrible, tragic thing. But I, I, my mom, I, my mom is definitely involved in this. I heard her on the phone getting calls from the inside, how everybody's trying to, everybody who's acting in unison, cooperating the same story right now is involved. And they're trying to throw it off on other people, bro. My brother has no real enemies. A lot of that entertainment stuff is fake. The only people who, who will try to harm him right now are the people who will benefit. Now that's crazy, right? Because when I heard him say that shit, everything he was saying, I'm, I'm like, you know, that fame shit is, is something else, right? And it's a trip because we all know Blueface Mama and his people, they definitely want they piece of the pie, right? But I don't know if they would go out their way like that, man, and just throw oh, bruh stack. You know what I'm saying? Son and bruh, even though Blueface, we know that him and his mama relationship has been rocky, right? And it's been, it's been... If you think about the squabbles, you think about some like how he, how it's like a lack of respect for mobs and, and hella shit like that. What Dre saying could kind of like make some sense, but it's sound far out too at the same time, bro. I'm not gonna lie, but 
you heard him, bro. He say they've been plotting against Face, and, and, and he say Face don't really got no enemy. That's why I'm not going to lie. For what he was saying about Face not having no enemies and getting in all these squabbles in jail, it kind of was, like, weird to me. Like, damn, why got it out for Face all of a sudden, right? And, and then, but then I'm thinking to myself, right, after hearing other things, too, like certain people, it's certain people who didn't have they certain rappers from L.A., right, who didn't have their experiences in, in L.A. County, and they say how it be kind of like a witch hunt for the rappers, nigga, and niggas be having it out for them, like, bro, we, you know what I mean? They want to teach the rap niggas, oh, a lesson or whatever the fuck when they come in here, so I'm like, it could be that, right, but then I'm like, bro, well, I don't know, bro. I don't. I, I just don't know. Like, what what the situation could be for niggas to have so much scrutiny towards face. But like I say, that's one reason. Another reason could be the, the situation we we heard that he had with 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 uh the South Sider who took his chain and this that and the third right that put him in a bad position as far as like with the Crips. And then you think about what Wack Wack One Hundred came out and said the day before yesterday, right? He was saying, oh uh uh uh. You know that Blueface is okay and he's in high power now. But the first thing we heard from Blueface is that he was in regular population and he was in there getting squabbles off and he loved it here and this, that, and the third. So it's it's conflicting stories a little bit, right? But it's just crazy. Uh, you know, it, it, one thing I will say, right, is we don't know what the hell's going on, right? Dre might be going through some mental issues, but it's like. His mental issues just now set in. You get what I'm saying? He been with moms and they been doing kind of like TV shows and shit. Remember he, him and his, remember him and Face was supposed to squabble on Blueface and Chris Sean's show, right? They was, they was getting into it and Dre, Dre don't, I'm going I'm to say this. He could be having some mental issues, but he don't seem to be, you know what I'm saying, all the way gone. He don't seem to be having that many mental issues, but bro, it's some crazy shit. And then if you think about Mom Dude, she was crying. You, and she, you know, she seemed sincere in what she was saying as far as like Dre having mental issues and this, that, and the third. But what I will say is why, why his mental issues just now settled in. You feel me? Now, I know niggas who didn't went and did a whole bunch of time, nigga. Unk just got home from doing thirty, doing a thirty piece, right? And Unk is still, Unk is still sound mentally. He's still cool. He ain't acting, he ain't acting weird or nothing. I know niggas who didn't did different st amounts of time too. I, and, and I ain't gonna lie, the time do affect certain niggas differently. You know what I'm saying? But they, they don't be they don't be all the way fucked up though. Like like what they trying to say Dre is they trying to say Dre is just having a mental breakdown. That's why he's saying the same thing. He he. I mean that's why he's saying the shit he's saying. But you know when you when you when you ain't in compliance is what I'm gonna say, right? Nigga, you will be made to look like a motherfucker. You know what I mean? That's just what the just, you know, that's just how shit be seeming, or that's just what they say. That's word in the industry. If you ain't acting right, you know, most of the motherfuckers who kind of like go off and veer off from the regular narrative, right? They say, oh, they only saying, they only saying I'm crazy because I'm not cooperating the shit that they want me to cooperate, right? And it's just some crazy shit, bro. I ain't gonna lie though, but, you know, that shit be a little far-fetched too, like, as far as like, what they be saying in the industry and what they be saying be happening and shit. You know what I'm saying? But we didn't. It, it's been a lot of shit too, as far as like with this Blueface and Krishan saga. You feel me? It's some clips you can go look up, and, and it's just certain shit, bro. That's just you know. For, I gotta be fair too and straight and say and give both perspectives, nigga. Because if not, it's gonna look like nigga. I'm just paid off or like I just. Nigga, just go with the natural narrative. No, nigga, I think for myself, nigga. But y'all niggas, let me know what y'all think, bro. Down below in the comment section. You think they is they about to get rid of blue phase and come back with a new phase? You get what I'm saying? And on some Gucci Mane type shit, or you think he just you think bro really having some mental issues, nigga? And he because mom seems sincere. She seems like he she you know what I'm saying? And then bro seems sincere, but crazy people can come off sincere too. Y'all niggas let me know what y'all think.